everyone. I wanted to do a video that I'm really excited about. I got this bag at Marshalls and it is beautiful. I have looked at this bag so many times. Um, I don't know, it seemed like every time I went there, from the very first time I saw it, I just kept going back to this bag. And the first time that I did see it hanging there, it kind of just like, <gasps> so I knew that I was going to just want it and love it ever since I saw it. This is called the Little Campbell. So of course, when I first saw this bag, I came home, I looked on Google, and the only thing that popped up was some images of this bag. No videos, no videos at all on YouTube. So I decided to go ahead and do a video because I'm super excited about this really pretty bag. And like I say, it's called the Little Campbell. And I think it retailed for $4.55 around in that area. And I got it for $149.99. And my daughter even put some money towards it for a late Mother's Day gift. Um, so that was exciting. But this is it. It has two handles that are rolled and they are padded. And I really love a Kate Spade bag that is quilted. Nobody else does a quilted bag like Kate Spade in the thickness and just beauty. I'm not saying like Chanel and everything, but all the other brands that I have seen that are quilted, she does the best job. I just love her quilting. It always just sticks out and so nice. This bag is really, really soft and beautiful. It smells so good if you love the smell of leather. This is the back of the bag. There is no pockets. This is the bottom of the bag and it shows that there is sections to the purse. It does have this front pocket and as you can tell, it has a gusset. So it's a good size pocket. This little bow I already had, and I just thought it was really pretty to stick on here because Kate Spade does put bows on most of her purses. So I thought it looked kind of fancy. And so does this chain strap with the leather in it. It is beautiful. And this bag, when you put it on your shoulder, it hangs at a really good length. Okay, now, I will start with this front pocket. It is like a twist, as you can tell right now. It looks like a diamond shape. So you just twist it into a square. That releases it and opens up the pocket. And the lining in this bag is so pretty. It's a cream color and all of these dots are gold. This is the front pocket. And with that gusset, it really holds a lot of stuff. I don't have that much in there, but I do have my little brush, my lipstick, a little lotion, a eyeglass cleaner, and a mirror. But this purse, here it is, empty. You can tell it would hold quite a bit. Now, the top of the purse looks like this. It's nice and secure. The pockets have a snap. And the only thing I have in this front pocket is this little um, bag that I have clippers and tweezers and little things like that you'll need while you're out, chapsticks. This little bag, I have my earbuds in. And then the only other thing I have in this section is a Body Fancy Fantasies Vanilla Perfume and or body spray really and it really smells good and it's only a dollar <laughs> for that size it also has two wall pockets the open ones but i don't have anything in those right now i'm thinking about carrying this with the strap hanging in the front just because it's pretty this back section i have i like to keep this anytime i have things in my handbag and I have sections. I like to keep my date book, my notebook, my pencils, 
anything like that that I'm going to be using to write with together in the same section. I do have my keys and a Bath and Body Works watermelon lemonade hand sanitizer. And then in my back wall pocket, it zips, I have band-aids, some floss sticks, my perk rewards cards, and a couple chewable times because I hate to be out. Say you've had dinner, maybe a little dessert, which gives you heartburn, and then you're going to go to a movie or something, and you don't want to be miserable. So this is the bag, and I really think it's beautiful. And I hope that this helps somebody, if you're like me, that was really wanting to see a video of this purse. I hope that I was giving you a good description of the bag. And really, it's not a heavy purse, not even with all my stuff in it. Now, the strap, it's comfortable. Maybe because the chain's a little bigger. It doesn't feel overly heavy. It feels more heavy on my shoulder than when I'm carrying it by the handles. So, I don't know, maybe I'm sure that this chain's adding a little bit more weight to it. But, I don't know that I would use this, say, like, on a long shopping day. I'm, I'm thinking it would end up being a little too heavy, even though it's not, it's not a heavy purse. But I just think it would be a little much, maybe if you were gonna shop for very long and you didn't have a buggy to set it in. But nevertheless, I love this purse. It's great quality, super soft leather, and it is so pretty. And this is the only one that my Marshall store had. So, I love quilted purses. I think they feel fancy. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.